Okay, guys, look at this. This light counter is gone. But I'm going to hit refresh. Are your ears really clean? Bam! In like Flynn, baby. See how I did that? You see that? So I was asked, what do you think about YouTube removing the dislike count? And my answer is, I'm going to have to give YouTube a dislike on that one. And the reason I say this is my opinion. Uh, I've been, I've got a small channel. I'm a small YouTuber. What this is supposed to be geared for a small YouTubers, right? Um, I've only got 30,000 subscribers. So that's to me, that's considered a small YouTuber, you know. Uh, once you get like 100,000, 250,000 subscribers, a million, you know, that's pretty much a, a full-time YouTuber. But I, I can't disagree with that. Uh, I think that the likes uh, actually helps me because, um, like I said, this is, this is just my opinion. Uh, by me being a African-American in my particular niche, right, and doing videos, I think it helps me to, to for people to see that I have like a 90 or 95% uh, like to dislike ratio, okay? Uh, as you can see, I'm right here in my YouTube studio. Um, and of course, I can see my dislikes and likes. I can, I'm, I'm, on your studio, you can you can see your, your dislikes. And like here, for instance, I only got one dislike. If I go down, 107 likes, one dislike. Next video, 77 likes zero dislikes okay so on and so forth look 100 percent right here okay this video 1700 views i got 74 likes zero dislike 100 percent okay so my thing i think it's important for people to see that because um by me being african maybe me being african-american okay even me right if i look at another african-american video and i see and i see joe blow video he had a a video on how to make uh how I make a million dollars in six months, and and, I, and all I can see is his likes. I don't see his dislikes. As soon as, he, as soon as he start off saying, "Yo, man, my name is uh, Joe Blow. I'm down here. Yo, yo, I'm gonna show you how to make a million dollars a month." I'm most likely gonna click off of it, right? But if I see that Joe Blow has a thousand likes and only twenty dislikes, then I'm gonna listen to him because he's probably a good teacher. He's probably got something good to say, right? All right, and uh, it's probably gonna teach me something, right? So that's why uh, I don't like that, cause you know, actually, for me, when I first started, okay, doing YouTube, of course, I had dislikes, right? As a matter of fact, let's watch this guy. What he's saying, the one who announced this uh, change, I don't know what this guy's name is. I guess he's an affiliate for YouTube. Let me see if I can find him. Okay, it looks like they took that video down. Uh, I don't know. But as you can see, this is the actual video right here. And you can see my man from EEV Blog uh, was talking about it also. This is the actual video. And what the guy was actually saying was that the reason that they did that was because people were botting, were, were botting or a robot, what they call botting, dislikes to certain uh, certain groups of people were, uh, were, were disliking, uh, a particular, particular videos uh, on purpose, uh, because they didn't like the person or they said something bad about somebody else or whatever. Um, you know, that's cool and all, but, uh, I'm pretty sure that YouTube could have figured out a way to get around that and, and, and find out if your video was being, you know, targeted, right? And they say another reason was, well, the main reason was because um, new YouTubers, okay, uh, newbies, right, were getting, they wanted to have, have a, make it fair. I don't know what that means, but for new YouTubers, because they were getting a lot of dislikes on their videos and they were kind of like, I guess, giving up or quitting YouTube. Okay, and like I said, I'm not a big YouTuber, 
I'm pretty sure every YouTuber start off the same way. Okay, when you first, this is the main thing what happens when you first start making YouTube videos. Okay, the reason that you get dislikes is because your video fucking sucks, bro. It sucks. Okay, I went through the same thing, right? That's why a lot of people are actually scared to do YouTube or they don't want to do it because number one, they're scared to get on camera, and number two, they feel that they're gonna their videos are gonna suck. And they are, man. There's no way around that. When you first start doing, when you first start doing YouTube videos, your videos are gonna effing suck. Your first one, your second one, your third one, okay? In most cases, right? Okay, because you're gonna be nervous. You like like me, I, I still get nervous. You know what I'm saying? So, but I'm just used to it, right? You know, it takes a while for you to get used to, you know, being in front of camera and seeing yourself on camera, whatever, right? And talking, right? But yeah, so what what YouTube actually needed to do instead of removing the dislike counter is that they should actually have put a like button okay right a dislike button right and they should have put a you suck button okay three buttons right all the counters on them, okay that's what they should have did right but they didn't right and then they were saying something about political reasons. They were doing it because, uh, for political reasons, actually, was supposed to be the real reason they did that. So, so like senators or whatever, when they they were always getting blasted with dislikes because a lot of people didn't like them. Now I know for a fact that's some bullshit because they already know people don't like them. They already know that. So they don't care about it. You get dislikes on their fucking video. They don't. Why would they? You know what I'm saying? It was, uh, president Trump or what, uh, President, uh, what's his name? Ben Laden. What's the new president now? Uh, Ben, Ben Diamond or whatever. You know, but they don't care about that. But actually, I'm just looking, I'm just speaking about the smaller YouTubers or the medium YouTubers. You know, it's important for people to see, for me to see that I got, you know, a, a, or, or anybody else that I have a, that they have a 95 or 90, 90% or higher, uh, like ratio, a uh, like to dislike ratio. Because people are going to take take it more seriously, and they're going to click on your video. They're going to watch your video. Okay, uh, you're going to get more watch time on your video. This is just my opinion, because it's common sense. Why wouldn't they watch your video longer if you have a ninety percent or higher, or even like a ninety five percent? Or you see on some of my videos at a hundred percent like ratio, right? So I'm only going to watch your video longer. But now since they remove that, they're making my job harder than trying to pull, uh, you know. 265 year old fat ladies out of a male strip club. Right? Okay, so I mean, so what am I gonna do now? Right? So, and I have noticed since November, and also I wanna show you guys something. This video, okay, I made this video, as you can see, this video is my top videos in the last 28 days, the most viewed videos. So, one of my most, one of the most viewed videos still, which are published back in 2019 is still the most viewed video um, every you know every every month or every year right and if I click on it watch this look at that 3,000 likes and 4,000 dislikes okay so why would I care right why would I care about dislikes when this is the most viewed video on my channel? All right. Almost close to a half a million views. Okay. And, you know, less than three years. So. Okay. So there is a solution where you can get your, you can actually see people's dislikes again. And if you're on Chrome, Google, you go to the Chrome Web Store and right here, or just go on Google, go on your search bar, return YouTube dislike .com. As you can see, that is the best one. Recently had over a half a million users, okay, um, so far, and it's got a five star already compared to these other ones already. And I'm going to go to YouTube. Okay, so you can just go to the Google search box. Put it up here, and you scroll down, you can see it. Return YouTube dislike .com right here, okay? Click on that. Hit install. I've already got installed. You hit install, and then it's automatically going to install 
just like that. Or you can just go to the Google Chrome store and install it like that. Now the only thing about this is that uh, it is it is not in real time. Uh, they say it's about two to three days uh, behind. Okay, so every two to three days after that, this like button refreshes. But that doesn't matter because at least you can get some kind of idea of where uh, the video is sitting as far as you're wasting your time or anything. Okay, so just, I'll put the link below in the description. I'll also put another link to some other videos that are very helpful as far as you um, load it up. But you just go there and install it. It takes like, uh, it takes like, fuck, it took like, man, 15 seconds to install. And I was back where I was supposed to be, right? Looking at people's videos and getting a, a like and dislike counter. And if it doesn't do it the first time, just refresh the video and it will come up. All right. So it's been working fine for me for the past couple of days. All right. So anyway, uh, that's all I need, want to say about that. Want to put my two cents in, right? About this dislike thing. So thank you guys for watching. And uh, until then, I will see you guys on the next one. Big dog out.